Having commands on your stream is a great way for your viewers to interact with your stream and with or maybe with you. So it, that's why I mean today's video gonna be going through exactly how you can set up and add commands using stream elements so with very easy. So if you do find this video helpful, remember to smash the like button down below and consider subscribing to your channel because I make tutorials just like this all the time that might help you out. So let's with that said, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing you want to do is obviously go to streamelements.com or stream elements website. So we're going to go to Google and type stream elements uh, like this and it will take you over here. Um, what you want to do next when you come to the home page is log into the account that you want the commands to be associ associated with. So if you stream on Twitch, log on Twitch. If we stream on YouTube, then log in for YouTube, etc. So I'm going to log in for Twitch because that's where I stream. So there we go and it will load. And when you when you successfully logged in, we'll take you to the dashboard. Now, guys, to add the stream elements chat box to your to your streams, you want to basically go to your stream elements dashboard on streamelements.com where you are right now. Look at your left hand side, and it will say here bot settings. If it says the bot is currently not in your chat, then basically it is not in your chat. So what you want to do now is click on the join channel, and if you're lazy like it says here, uh, you can click on the little configure button here, and stream stream elements will take care of it um and will basically take care of everything to add it to your channel so if you click here it will be added automatically to my twitch channel because if you look here at well this is my alt account by the way it will say here stream one spot is, is running and it will be a little moderator uh, moderator icon next to it you, if it doesn't work for some reason you just go to the chat off your channel type in slash mod and then stream elements make sure that you type in that type that in correctly because otherwise basically someone else named whatever you typed in will get mod on your channel which which is not good um so yeah uh, if we look at the left hand side there are a lot a lot and a lot of things that stream elements provides us streamers um that might help us grow a lot actually so what you what you want to do is scroll all the way down to bot or well the the tab bot and then chat commands it will take you to this little page and here there are different types of commands or two different types of commands there are default commands and custom commands so essentially well default commands are are commands generated by stream elements and I have t taken some or I have t um, turned some off uh, but some I've kept because I feel like they are important for my stream so there are for example leaderboard for your points uh, follow age which, which is actually really cool um you got you got a commands command where you can see a list of all your commands account age age etc you can you know play around and see what which commands of the default commands that you want to keep and but now we have the custom commands which obviously is the are or are the commands that you make so to create a command you you obviously click, click on add new command and it will take over here you can make a command from scratch but there are also some templates that that stream elements has pre-made so for example if uh, you want to have a, a command that says uh, what game you're playing at the moment then you can click on game and it will make a pre-made pre one uh, Whatever name your channel is is playing whatever game you're playing or whatever game it says that you're playing on Twitch uh, But let's say that you want to create an, a brand new command then you type in whatever you want the command to to na be named basically so let's say that you uh, I don't know hello you want to do a command set that says hello you can set who should be el eligible to type in this, this command or well to get an answer from it so maybe you want only subscribers to get to get uh, a, 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 an answer from it or or maybe everyone i suggest they have it in everyone unless it's something very important and then you ha type in an, an response that you want the well the bot to answer so so maybe the response is just hello with smile face now you can also have some advanced settings but i i suggest that you don't really bother these you can uh you can change it if you really want to but i i suggest you don't um then you hit but when you feel like you're done with it with it you, then you click on activate command and this command will be activated to your channel you can basically use it and now when you activated your command then you can then you're free to use it and everyone that that are eligible to type in the command will be able to use it on your streams so if we go over to my Twitch channel, uh, you want first off want to make sure that you, that stream elements is in your is in your channel that it, that is activated. But now if you type in hello the command that was just created, hello, 
oh sorry like that then streamlines replies with hello smiley face so if you do have any questions then make sure you drop them in the comment section down below i'll try to help you out i, I answer all comments and if you did find any of this helpful then remember to hit that like button down below sub and consider subscri subscribing to your channel with the bell notifications on so you get notified when i upload ne the next video so with that said see you next video Storks out